The city of Crosby's government looks a little bit different after the creation of a new position. Clayton Castle has that story. A new year brings new changes in many local governments, but in the city of Crosby, a shift in structures being implemented to better serve the people. We've known for many years in the past that how we were organized didn't function particularly well. Currently, all city departments such as police, fire, and library all report to the city council. Mayor Novak says that chain of command just doesn't suit the city of Crosby any longer. We didn't have particularly good control of um, necessarily performance, uh, accountability. Uh, we had a hard time sharing resources uh, across different functions. With that, a new city position has been created. It will add responsibilities to our existing clerk treasurer and become an administrative administrator position. Mayor Novak says that the city council has been more unified lately and that was shown when Lisa Silva was appointed to the new city administrator position by an unanimous decision. That means that the council is uh, is working as a team and uh, providing the support that I'm going to need to be successful. And, um, and that's very important to me. I'm very grateful for that. Sova says this new structure of governing will not only benefit the city of Crosby, but the broader community as well. Just look for opportunities to share among our, uh, our own departments and then look for opportunities to share outside of the city uh, with our neighboring communities, um, with the county, the state, and, and just look for um, every opportunity we can to do, to do better for the residents. The new city administrator position will be fully implemented throughout the year. Reporting in Crosby, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Silva has been working with the city of Crosby as clerk treasurer for the past six years. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.